What's going on, y'all, man? It's L.A. Rich, and we back with another video, man. And look, would you look who we have here, man? We got, I think it's called Mark, Mark Memories or Mark A, Mark E, whatever it is. Y'all let me know in the comments how to say it. Memories SB19. Now, look, this is another sit-down video from SB19, man. And y'all, let me tell y'all, I like they sit-down videos a lot, man, no matter what it's about. I just like seeing their um, personalities all together because they genuinely got some great personalities, man. And when I see them, I'm able to tell every single time on how just genuine they is, man. Like, these dudes is really genuine, bro, when it comes to how close of a bond they have and how they re interact with their fans. I ain't going to say fans, supporters. Supporters and everything, bro, you feel me? And I, I just like seeing that when it comes to groups now. And just artists in general, because you don't see it a lot no more. You genuinely don't. Um, but you definitely see it with them, which is why I keep on reacting to them. But before I even get into the vid, I want to say thank y'all for helping me hit 5.8 thousand subscribers. We're going to roll up to 5.9 now. I appreciate every last one of y'all for the love and support y'all show me on a day to day basis. It truly means the most to me. Nonetheless, we're going to go ahead and get into this vid. Y'all make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know some more videos to react to. And, and hey, Let's do it, man. Everyone, we are SB19. And these are our marquee memories. First okay, so the marquee is that it's 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 pronounced marquee. Okay, I already know before y'all had to correct me, but so it's their first concert. Alright, now this makes sense. First concert that I've had was actually in my hometown in Emos. They call it like the Battle of the Bands. And that was a really, really long time ago. I was still like 12, I think. So, oh, so that's 30 years, 30 years ago. <laughs> 30 years ago. <laughs> 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 yeah, so 30 years ago. 42. Just 29 years ago. Yeah. Okay. But, but I really enjoyed that show and I really had fun and it was one of the best experience that I've attended to. For me, the first... Okay, the, the first, your first entire show was at 12 years old. That is crazy, bro. That is wild. But I didn't I didn't know um, Josh had did solo stuff before, before he um, got with SB19. That's what's up, though. Fun and it was one of the best experience that I've attended to. For me, the first concert that I attended was also a k-pop concert it was um team top did you know that um in that concert i don't know yet josh and stell but they performed as an opening act during that time yeah so i don't know them but i already watched them perform i've heard it wait hold on wait you know so josh and stell have performed on their own or with each other as like a duo yeah i'll let me know in the comments about that but so he did they they didn't even know each other at that point and justin was sitting in the crowd watching them the whole time not knowing later this gonna end up being a group you do music with that is crazy to hear bro real talk yeah so i don't know them but i already watched them perform i've heard that post malone had a concert here in la so i went to his concert it was really really fun amazing experience since it, it was my First time to go uh, on a concert with a favorite artist. Uh, me and Josh, we're in a cover group. We represent okay, the Philippines. We compete artist. with other countries. After the competition, there's a concert. That's the time where we met BTS that time. Right now, they're a big artist. And back then, they're just starting. They inspired me to be who I am now. They become uh, a big impact to me as an artist also. My goal that time was to be on the same stage and perform and to show the world my talent. And after that night, I decided to keep on doing what I do and just keep on performing until people appreciate my talent, my skills. And until now, that's what I always have inside me. Oh, that's nice. That's what's up. Hey, that's what we don't see a lot now too, man. When it comes to artists in general, you do not see artists going out here and giving credit or saying that somebody inspired them to do something or inspired them to get into music or something. Why do we not see it no more? Because at the end of the day, it's too many artists that's sitting out here too stuck up with they self, not trying to give nobody, you know, just thinking that they too good for everybody, man. And this is what I tell you. This group is genuine, bro. Straight up. 
know, that's what I always have inside me. Oh, that's nice. Blackpink! The first concert that okay, we Black attended Pink. all together was in the Philippines. It was in the uh, Philippine Arena. Yeah, last March 2023 and it was a Blackpink concert. We expect a lot for Blackpink because we all listen to it. We even danced a Blackpink song before when we were just starting trainees. So uh, we were excited to see them in person. So it was fun because um, we were standing and then when, when the song came in, we just jump and have fun, jive to the song. And I also just want to say that the production is really good because there were bands, there were um, dancers that were really, really great. The costumes are very, very nice and they're all giving their all. The showmanship is, you know, up top. We were just really amazed and overwhelmed during that time. And just like, you know, kids, we just enjoyed the performances. After the show, we, we were like kind of talking about we want to we want to have a big show just like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We want to have a bigger production for our concert for our tour next time. So we kind of it kind of inspires That's us right. to 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 push to 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 move forward. Yeah. The most. See, look, they already sitting here mentioning being inspired about three times now, bro, by other groups and artists and everything, man. That's what I mean, bro. Like. You're not getting that out of a lot of artists and groups today saying that they got inspired or something from another group had inspired them. What I tell y'all, man, this group thing is one of the few people that's out here that actually don't care about being stuck up or nothing these days, you feel me? To, to push, to, to, to move forward, yeah. The most memorable for us is our kickoff concert. For the very first time, we did a two-day concert and it was full house. So we were just really, really happy. And it was the first time that we performed on stage with a band, with dancers, and with all the, the good effects. For us, it was the perfect show and the perfect crowd. We're not just the only ones performing, but also the audience. Yeah, it's they the, dance with us. It's the, it's the song Crimson and Bozinga. The favorite song that I I always like to perform. Hold on, let me guess this one. I'm gonna go ahead and guess right here. I'm gonna say it's either Gento or I Want You. Them two right there. I'm gonna guess that's his favorite. Maybe I'm wrong. Hey, let's find out though. Crimson and Bazinga. The favorite song that I I always like to perform is called Mana. Damn. Bro, I thought, I, I, damn, bro. I, I was going to say either I want you or that, bro. I chose I want you instead of that, bro. Damn. The favorite song that I, I always like to perform is called Mana. It gives me this kind of energy or kind of soul that when I perform that song, it feels like... You have superpowers. Yeah, I have superpowers, exactly. We recently... It's um, crazy, because I even said the same thing with that song, too. I think I remember, I was like, this song just got such an uplifting and powerful vibe to it, and I definitely was feeling that same energy, too, just even off hearing it, you feel me? Like... You have superpowers. Yeah, I have superpowers, exactly. We recently... Um, built our own company, so we're self-managed now. We didn't know That's if what's we could up. really make it. And seeing how everyone enjoy the concerts, even the fans and even the staff, it's just very fulfilling and very memorable for me. I know that everyone worked really hard for this moment to come, and it's really a blessing to ha uh, have this kind of opportunity to perform overseas and to be able to introduce your music to a different crowd. That's the most fulfilling and most memorable thing uh, with this concert. Yeah. Thanks for listening to our Marquee Memories. Catch us on our Point to Tag World Tour to make your own memories. Hey man, that's what's up bro. I like this video a lot, man. Like I said, I love they sitting down videos to watch them and everything because and to for me to uh for y'all to watch me watch them you feel me when it comes to they sit down videos because it's just an overall great vibe all throughout you feel me with y'all watching and everything it just give you a more of a chill like just sit down and relax and vibe to just sit and just watch you feel me and they got the it's be funny it's just a whole bunch of genuine shit going on that you would love to just sit and sit and watch because in this damn world you don't get to see a lot of people Watch that in with y'all watching it too, watching me react to it.
and just bring up like a huge group just sitting and watching some genuine shit. So I'm, of course, I'm gonna keep on doing these damn reactions to them. Of course, especially the sit down ones too, you feel me? But hey, once again, thank y'all for helping me hit 5.8 thousand subscribers. We're up to 5.9 now. I appreciate every last one of y'all for the love and support y'all show me on a day to day basis. It truly means the most to me. Nonetheless, that's going to close out the vid. Y'all make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know some more videos to react to. Every single, any any type of video, and I got y'all with it. Hey, it's LA Rich, and I'm getting up out of here. All right, y'all. I need to deflate up everyone. I just got the ways I boost it up, but I'm not real. Shoot a ready, go to ready, blaze they hit up everyone. Every time I did a give a shit, I still ain't number one. In my pockets, bear with many, bitch, like fucking